these boys in the hostel don't listen to any teachers they'll always create problems they always get punishment they they are always made to stand outside the classrooms they run here they run there so i decided to go to the hostel and i called those boys and i asked them why there should be a complaint against you that i got a complaint that you are not listening to your teachers and immediately they got frightened and they said i'm sorry i'm sorry guruji i have listened to teachers i said no 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 you should not listen to teachers they were very shocked <laughs> and they looked at me i said will you listen to teachers they said they will listen i said no you should not listen to teachers the moment you listen to teachers you become you forget to listen to yourself i said listening to you trying to control your sense organs and trying to control your discipline in what direction you wanted that will help the teacher from not complaining because teachers want you to be listening to you and once you listen you become 100% uh, 100 out of 100 in your lessons rakum said i don't listen to anybody but we listen to everybody and he said we don't listen to anybody i gave them a comparison to those children <clears throat> i am an example i don't listen to anybody very naughty and everybody was complaining so when everybody was complaining i got a chance to be alone you may call it lonely maybe i was lonely that made me to strengthen my body because i have to go from one area to another area fights break up <laughs> and i cannot carry uh, groups with me so i thought the best way is to make myself very strong the moment i started practicing and making myself very very strong i had excess of energy when i had excess of energy i started sharing that excess of energy and uh, that excess of energy helped quite a lot of people and in that excess of energy when i started sharing without expecting anything and I, there's no expectations i just wanted to give with love not even expecting love from there i said maybe some maybe i expected uh, but my naughtiness and my st- stupidity in my young days people were always scared to come close to me so i just started giving so i told these boys that listening to uh, yourself making yourself very very strong because the teachers gives you everything free of cost that knowledge you don't get in any part of the world and this is the best chance to always accept all that knowledge if you are conscious and then you make yourself very strong when you listen to yourself there won't be any complaint because teachers listen to you when you get 100 out of 100 and you you go to the stage and then you make people listen you don't even have to ask people to clap for you, including your teachers will clap for you look he got 100 out of 100 but you are not going to give any money back to them in the interest they are just happy that you got 100 it is their knowledge try to understand that you another one thing the complaint came from the from them was uh, that the after the teachers um, advised them which is uh, uh, regular with every schools they make actions against the teachers like this So I told them one story. One of our, some of our senior students, <laughs> in the degree time, they had a fight with the hostel warden. The hostel warden is also a postgraduate child. So we shifted them to another school, another branch, but there also did not work out. So we asked them to leave the school, or they left the they left the institute. And one girl came back and told me. oh it was terrible time back at home back with the community food was very very difficult only then we realized the importance of your school and i found that among our team one group got a job in garments factory 
so I went rushing up to them and please uh, give me also a job. And they said, no, 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 we cited ourselves as finding difficulty to get a job. Please don't come here. How will I get you? She was uh, partially blind. No, no, we cannot get it. So this girl goes to another girl's house who was uh, married and our ex children married and a little well settled. She went to her house and that girl said, no, 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 my in-laws will not uh, allow. They get very angry. I'll be in trouble. Don't come to my house. <laughs> the, so I told these boys, that is because this girl, whenever Guruji scores or senior scores, she used to joke by making hand actions and talking from behind. So the friends also heard, knew they were encouraging with the clap. But when they were outside the school campus, when she went to ask for help, they knew this girl might talk from behind. So those actions are not good. Try to control your actions. Today you might get a chapale, that is a clap. In Canada, clap and chapli is very closely, close, it closely rhymes. Chapale means clap and chapli means slipper. <laughs> and these people got that slipper. I don't listen to anybody, but we listen to everybody. Then I told these boys, look, Guruji worked very, very hard and uh, just sharing, people just followed us. And now you got a building, a beautiful security, you got your clothes, good clothes, good food. Even if I'm sitting in Devanagali also, in Indranagar collections keep moving because people know that this man, whatever we give, he will just share it up. Sharing is beautiful. Learn the art of sharing. I also told them that uh, the ex-student Shashita told me this one story. Uh, Guruji, in 10th standard, uh, maybe we get a chance to copy. So most of the ch children uh, won't study very well. But I made sure I have to study. So I studied very, very well. You told me, you know, 100 is 100. Do not depend, do not look into an another person's uh, pocket, another person's paper. I studied very well. Because I studied very well in 10th standard, Oh, I reached PUC. It was very, very easy. I, I got selected for engineering. He completed his engineering campus interview was selected by an MNC. So I told them this story to study very well. This is the only opportunity you get from the teachers. I don't listen to anybody, but we listen to everybody. Once you don't listen to anybody, you listen to yourself, make yourself very strong. Then you will listen to everybody. Means the third day asking, I told, I told the hospital warden, you asked me only for a job, but I gave you clothes, food, security. Make the children to listen to you. Yes, you will listen to everybody. By giving so many things, you are listening to everybody. Be like that. Listen to you. And you will listen to the whole world. Whole world listens to you too.